Now at 11, just a tragedy as we're learning much more about a fiery crash that killed two teenagers and seriously injured another just days ago this past weekend. You're watching Queen 6 News at 11. I'm Elizabeth Din. I'm Jeff Gianola, and according to police, these are the 10th and 11th traffic-related deaths this year in Portland. Joyce O'Gary live in downtown tonight with more on this tragic story. Joyce? Jeff and Liz, Portland police are still collecting evidence. They say based on the damage at the scene that this crash was a result of street racing. You think twice before they uh, involve themselves in this. It's not fun and games. It's dangerous and people are, are dying. That's the message from Portland Police Sergeant Kevin Allen. After two teenagers were killed in a fiery car crash on North Marine Drive last week. Two cars were involved, according to police. One of the cars caught on fire. The driver suffered serious injuries. 16-year-old Christian Perez Hernandez and 18-year-old Gabriel Sanchez were found dead inside that burnt car. A makeshift memorial has been set up to remember the teens. They both attended Park Rose High School. This message was sent to families from the superintendent. The Park Rose community is small and close-knit, and the impact of a tragic event such as this hits hard. Every effort to respond to the needs of all our students is being made. This includes providing resources for them to deal with intense feelings. Portland police say street racing was involved in this crash. Marine Drive is a very popular uh, place for people engaging in street racing and speeding activities. It's a you know wide open, uh, straight stretch of road. When we do street racing missions, that's often an area that we'll focus on. Sergeant Allen tells us it takes a lot of manpower for these street racing missions. In the past, street racing has led to intersections in Portland being shut down for hours. We want people to have fun and we want these kids to, to have activities that they enjoy, but we want to make sure that they don't pay you know, the ultimate price like what happened here. Um, it's just, it's, it really is heartbreaking. And this is such a tragedy that's hurting a lot of families. So police say it's a reminder of the consequences of street racing. Live in downtown Portland, Joyce O'Geary, Coin 6 News.